So this is Seth Killian here at Tokyo Game Show 2010, showing off some of our new Marvel vs. Capcom 3 characters. Uh, this would be Dormammu, uh, eternal enemy of Doctor Strange. He's not quite the devil, he's uh, a lot of things. But he's actually quite maneuverable in a lot of ways, but basically he's a sort of a keep-away type of character. So think of like a Dalsim, or if you played Marvel vs. Capcom 2, uh, Blackheart, definitely one of the inspirations. So you see a lot of uh, portal type moves like this, which he can pull out in a variety of places on the screen, uh, sort of near, medium, or far. This is Dark Hole, uh, very good stuff there. That is indeed what it's called, I don't pick the names. Um, it's also effective in the air, and uh, you know, I love that 8-way dash so much. So there you see him leaving a little fire on the ground, which uh, He's also able to call the portal there, uh, very Blackheart-esque. So really a character all about the space control. I'm actually calling a portal that's not even appearing on the screen. Uh, he's also got some great command normals. This one is just toward and C. We'll actually generate what we call a wall bounce, which you're able to combo after. Um, so I can do things like... Well, I think I can do it. I'm causing the little fire on the ground there. You see what you ran into. And uh, his supers... He's got a standard sort of uh, fireball beam super, very effective. He's also got, that's probably too close to really show it off, but it's a tracking super that looks a lot like Dalsim's super from uh, Street Fighter IV, uh, the big yoga fire that will sort of uh, fly out and then track you around no matter where you go. Very effective, a lot of setups you can do off that. So Dormammu really effective on the space control, uh, being just sort of generally evil. Awful guy, has a cool throw we'll show off here. Again, he's got um, teleports uh, in the air. He can also fly um, briefly. It only makes sense. He's got his own dimension and is basically always fighting for control of the universe. Only the Sorcerer Supremes can take him out. Thor with a little hammer spin there. Oh, I missed with the grab there. But that's Dormammu in a nutshell. Um, for fans of Blackheart, fans who like unusual characters, and uh, anybody who's just sort of generally evil. He can also power up his hands, we'll talk more about that. You see some of, uh, it gives him sort of new specials in every case. Once he powers up his hands, you see the spike, a uh, little explosion. Power of uh, chaos and hatred. So he's got a variety of really creative specials that really help him control the entire screen uh, effectively when used in concert with assists, uh, which is really what Marvel vs. Capcom is all about, calling in assists and really getting that teamwork. You get a great overall uh, experience and can really lock down the opponent. They won't know where to go.